All right, Mr. guys, it's Mr. McCarthy here. We're the, going to change a tracheostomy. Take the whole old one out that has a cuff in it and put in a new one, okay, without a cuff so that the patient can talk better. All right, we're going to be putting in a extra long trach. That's how it looks. All right, so we're going to start to prepare our area. We also have in tidal CO2. You see that it's purple. Once I put it in an airway, it should turn yellow. Let us know we're in the airway. It takes the CO2. Also using an introducer bougie that will hold the space. Relax. Okay. Relax. Huh? Breathe. You're breathing fine. Yeah, you're breathing fine. Just relax. It'll be just on the tray. Alright. I'm gonna remove the cushion out. Alright. looks like don't use the powder that we have I'm going to apply some KY jelly on the actual tray so it's nice and slick. Just relax. You nervous. No reason to be nervous. You're getting ready to tell us everything you want to tell us now instead of writing on that board, right? All right. I'm not going to hurt you. You'll feel a little pressure. Put a little lot of cane in here so it's going to help you. Okay. You okay? Make a call. It's okay. A little lot of cane. It's going to numb it up a little bit so that way you don't feel it. Or you feel it less. Okay? Now I want to cut your, these, uh, the ties. That's all I'm doing. Such a long way. Such a long way. Take the inner cannula out. Inner cannula. And the bougie. A little pressure. A little pressure. All right, here we go. Pull the old one out. Here comes the new one. Oh, you're all done, baby. Inner cannula. Always maintain control of your trachea. We have entitled. Turn yellow, so we're definitely in the airway. All right, now all we have to do now is put the new tires on. 
And the ties is just a regular trike tie. You can hold that spot for me. Flip on this side and we'll be done, okay? Oh, that's pulling on okay. the side. Right, the hyper-oxygenate your patient. Feel good? All right. Slow down. There you go. Cats look good. All right, let's make it secure. It's in there, it's gonna make it a little tighter. And we'll put another, another one on there in a little while for the double tie. And then we'll secure the trach mask itself. Wonderful job. See, that wasn't bad, was it? All done. Now we'll see if you if your speaking valve is a little bit more easier to use produce a crap. Hold on. So this was the trait that was removed. You notice it has a balloon on it. Even though the balloon was deflated, it still uses up a lot of space. So it's harder for the patient to get a good uh, speak, be able to speak around it if that cuff is there. So now the one we put in does not have a cuff. So it frees up a little real estate inside of her trachea in hopes that she can produce a better sound with her speaking. Let's see. Speaking valve here. Passing valve here. Alright, what's your name? Oh, hold on. What is, hold on. Oh yeah, don't okay. Well just say one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Much better. Does it feel better? Yeah, so you're gonna keep working on getting your voice strong, okay? But we can hear you much much better than you could. Alright? Don't say your name yet because you we we don't want your information out. Alright, but we just want you to practice talking, okay? Whenever you want something, try to talk and not use that board as much as possible, okay? All right, so that was a trait change from a cuffed extra long trait to a cuffless extra long trait.